glamping in Washington, get the both the best worlds basically. You get like the backpacking world if you like going out and seeing beautiful views, going on a hike. And then if you like to be comfortable, you get that as well. You can pull your camper up to site, you have full hookup, water, bathroom access, get the whole shebang, you know. What is glamping? It's just glamorous camping. Just camping with comfortability, you know? How about we just show you what glamping could be like? So what can you do while glamping? Well, you get the benefits of sleeping on an air mattress. And having a pillow. <laughs> glamping allows you to bring nice coolers that keep your food cold and then you let me just take you through a day of glamping in washington with the family so typically we'll start the day off with a big breakfast pancakes or a breakfast sandwich my dad is usually the one who takes up the morning cooking and honestly it basically feels like a tradition at this point to get the breakfast sandwich on the first morning of camping usually everyone helps out with this task by getting food or setting up the table and putting everything away at the end of it Honestly, though, it's those morning breakfasts during those camping days that just make the day and get it started and get you just going the right way you want to be going. This is typically what our campsite will look like. We got a camper and four tents here. Most of the tents are with Walmart's cheap twin-sized air mattresses, which are surprisingly not too bad. All right, let's take a look inside of my dad's camper. So right when you get inside, you'll see my sisters are playing some solitaire, avoiding the bugs and the heat right now. And then you'll take a look to your left. We got the counter, a sink, and there's a stove top right there as well. And then he has a Dometic fridge in here, which keeps the food and condiments really nice and cool. And then as we go in further, we have uh, some cabinetry and then the bathroom in the far back. And then right to the right of the bathroom is a twin set of beds. We got a sink and um, a shower in here, which is really nice. And of course, you know, a toilet, running water. You know, we're not actually plugged in. And then we got an air conditioner, but to run the air conditioner, you need an, a generator, which is really essential when you're glamping with a camper. So typically during the day, what we'll usually do is just either lounge around, play some solitaire, eat some snacks, and then, or just play some Frisbee right here in the campsite. Just basically enjoy the day in any way, shape, or form that you can. So just enjoy this quick little montage of us frisbeeing, and then I'll show you what else we do here in Washington when we're glamping. So check this out. There's a trail that goes around a lake here that we're camping at, and it's literally, I don't know, 75 yards from my tent. I just go into these backwoods, take a left, get on the main trail. You'll see it's very clear. It's like cut grass or, you know, dirt right there. And then bam, it's a trail. So enjoy as I give you a quick tour of this trail around the lake.
So the best way to end a day when you're glamping with your family or friends is to gather around the campfire after a long day of various activities, of hanging out. You just pull up the camp chairs, you bring out the s'mores, you bring out whatever you like to roast on the, the fire, basically, and you just enjoy each other's companies under the starry night. It's one of the best feelings, I think, out there when you're camping, just enjoying each other's time, enjoying the warmth of the fire, just spacing off. That being said, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you got some motivation or you learned something about glamping, motivation to go glamping yourself or just to go camping, you know. You don't even need a camper. You don't need none of that. You just need a tent. You just need to go out there and plan it all out and just enjoy nature and enjoy the, your company. And that's, that's what it's all about. That being said, take her easy.